Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a really highly requested video for you guys, which as you can tell by the title is my skincare routine. So a lot of you guys over on my vlog channel have asked to see a skincare routine. So that is what I'm doing today. I love it when you guys leave me comments and like video suggestions and stuff like that. So if you have any Christmas or any just videos you'd like to see from me in the future, please make sure to leave them down below. We can have a chat and something. You do have to bear with me. I've I've just come in from college I've got a cold at the moment so if I sound a little bit bummed up or whatever that is why um, I just really really wanted to film this video and get it up for you guys just ignore the coldy appearance <laughs> so to start I think it's probably best for me to say that I've had sort of a a bit of a journey with my skin like from probably the ages of 12 to 13 to up to maybe a year or so ago I've definitely been on a constant like journey and like an up and down sort of cycle with that if you guys want to see a more like in-depth video of sort of my whole journey through it the sort of things I got prescribed from the doctor the dermatologist because when I was going through like a bad skin sort of time um, I found it really useful to watch videos and see what other people have tried out and stuff so if you guys want to see more of like a story time chatty video then be sure to let me know because I will definitely get around to doing that for you today I just want to show you the sort of current products that I am using day to day morning and night um, and hopefully this could help you in some way or you can just see what I like to put on my face I've always had quite a good skincare routine like I'd say Say, because I struggle with my skin I always watch videos and I always was watching other youtubers and like I've always had sort of a routine of cleansing toning um, moisturizing all that kind of thing whereas some of my friends when I was younger just didn't have any of that they'd just take their makeup off with a makeup wipe and they'd be good to go but unfortunately for me that was just not enough for my skin I feel like I've got myself at the moment into a good routine that I'm happy with that my skin's happy with and I believe that I'm looking at all the products on my bed um, I believe that none of these products are above £10 and I could even say that they're not even above £5 that's not to say that I'd never branch out on skincare because I think it's definitely worth it and I have done um, on certain things in the past um, but at the moment I'm currently on sort of like a, a drugstore skincare routine and I'm I'm really happy that I'm making this video at this current time because when I was struggling when I was younger I did not have the budget to be buying a £25 moisturiser that some of the YouTubers that I was watching at the time used so I feel that this could be beneficial for you guys that are on a budget and just don't want to splash out but want to take good care of your skin okay so before I ramble on for about two days I think how I'm going to do this I'm going to start with what I tend to do in the morning then what I do in the evening and then just sort of any other general bits and bobs that I feel are important so every morning when I wake up I go in the shower and use the simple kind to skin moisturizing face wash so this is what um, what it looks like here. This is just a really really hydrating um, face wash. I have to say um, before this video goes any further I promise you that I'm not remotely in any way sponsored by Simple. I've just got a lot of their products at the moment and they're working for me. So yeah this is just um, a face wash. It's obviously from Simple there's no nasty anything there's no bad things in these products anyway and it says it's 100% soap free so I just go in the shower Put, pop this all on my face in the morning just to give it a nice refresh but it doesn't leave my skin feeling like tight or anything it's just a really nice refreshing wash in the morning and then when I come out of the shower I've been using this and this is a newer item in my skincare routine this is a hydrating mist and this is from the super drug range they're like vitamin E range um, I've used a couple of products um, like this in the past and they have worked well for my skin and I saw this the other day maybe a few months ago when I went so not really the, the other day is it so I saw this a couple of months ago, picked it up, but I love it and it's so refreshing to just spray on your face like before makeup and stuff like that. I just haven't really seen anything like this from the drugstore before and it leaves my skin feeling very, very nice. So that's what I've been doing in the morning. Oh, before we go any further, I will say that my skin is to be honest I'd say pretty normal a couple of years ago I would tell you it was completely combination 
parts of my skin are really oily, parts of my skin are dry. But right now, um, my current sort of time and place, um, my skin is pretty normal and yeah, that might help you guys out whilst watching this video. So after I sprayed my face in the morning, I will then go on to use the simple Kind to Skin Replenishing Rich Moisturiser. Now this is what this one looks like. I have been using this for probably years now. Um, there is another one and it's not as moisturising, but I have been using... I have been using this one for years and it does the job, it moisturises my skin, ready for makeup, ready for the day and I just get on with it really well, doesn't cause me to break out, it's just a good standard moisturiser. So that's basically what I do in the morning, I literally cleanse, pop a bit of the hydrating mist or toner on my face, moisturise and then I'm good for the day. So now moving on to sort of my evening routine, I'd say it's a bit more in depth than sort of my morning because I've had makeup and whatever else on my face during the day. Starting out I will take the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water, I feel like everyone uses this and I remember watching YouTubers when they use Bioderma and I could not get my hands on it but when Garnier brought this out, I was straight on that and I've been using it ever since. This is just great, I've got no problems using it around my eyes or anything like that. Um, you guys will have seen this before, know what it looks like. Just take that with a cotton pad and get as much makeup off as I can. I then will go in the shower again when I have my evening shower um, and I will use the simple Spotless Skin Triple Action Face Wash. This contains zinc and chamomile for visibly clearer skin. Now this is what this face wash looks like. Um, I have been using this for a while now. I remember buying it when my skin was going through a bit of a breakout. Um, use this and this definitely helped to clear up my skin. This is a different range of like the simple stuff to the other products that I have, but I really like this. But I have to tell you that my little like secret weapon is this funny looking pink pad and now if you've never seen one of these before i hold it up closely you're probably thinking do you know what on earth is that so this little wonder pad i tell you works miracles so i pop my face wash on this is in the evening and it's a little exfoliating pad and i just rub this all over my face and it's bendy so it gets into all the cracks and all the bits and bobs and everything like that. So I literally rub my face mask, face mask, no, rub my face wash into my skin with this every night. It's not harsh and it works wonders. It clears, you know, you can wash your face and everything, but you don't know what good your hands are doing rubbing it all in. But with this little thing, it really gets in there and just takes all the crap that is on your face out of your face. Um, and I, Honestly guys, I got mine from Tiger for like a pound. They sell them in Primark for like a pound. Just pick one up and try it because I'm pretty sure that you won't regret it. So this, with this, in the shower at night, wonderful, wonderful combination. So then once I'm out of the shower, I've washed my face and everything, um, I will then move on to toning. Like I do in the morning, I either take the hydrating mist from Superdrug or I take this, um, another simple product, I take the simple um, soothing facial toner. This is 100% alcohol free. I've been using this for as long as I can remember to tone my skin. So that is what the bottle looks like. Um, I literally take this on a cotton pad all over my face. If there's anything left, it gets it off, it refreshes my face, it makes it feel all smooth and nice. And if you are looking for an affordable toner, definitely, definitely try this one. In the evening, I either take one of these, just whatever I'm feeling. Um, and then after I've toned my face, I let that all sink in, I will then take this Vitamin C Detox Skincare. Um, this is a serum. This is from Superdrug as well. And like the Vitamin E range, this is a new range that they have and it's the Vitamin C range. I'll just hold that up so you can see. So this is what it looks like. It is, um, I believe, a new um, line, but it's got a little like squeezy syringy thing i'm not even going to try and say what this contains but anyway it claims to detoxify your skin infuse with vitamin c leaves skin softer and brighter and i do believe that it does do those things that it says on the little oh, jar pot bottle 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 um yeah so i just um, place a few drops of this on my face 
rub it in all down my neck and everything and along with the exfoliating pad and using brightening things like this I you I like to use hydrating things because I feel like my skin can look quite dull um, but yeah this definitely helps it does something it's good I'm glad I picked it up go and try it it's really really affordable for something like this that people buy for crazy amounts of money um, but yeah definitely try this and let me know what you think so after that's all set into my face um, I will then usually go back in with the simple moisturizer sometimes I don't feel like I need to do this if I feel like my skin's hydrated enough but the majority of the time I will go back in with my moisturizer and just pop this on my face and that's the finishing product like for the night I feel like my skin is clear it's clean it's ready for bed and ready to like repair itself overnight okay so I think that's pretty much the main things that I want to share with you now I have to tell you about the things that I use maybe on a weekly basis the first thing another simple product I know I know I'm sorry but what can you do so this is the facial scrub with rice granules if you are wondering um i use this maybe once a week maybe on a sunday night to like prep my skin for the rest of the week this is really really good it does what it says on the tubey tube it just it just exfoliates all the dead skin cells off your skin and it does leave it feeling baby baby soft yeah there's nothing bad to say about this there's no harsh chemicals or anything but yeah this is just a really really good exfoliator that i tend to use weekly okay last thing which i feel like is a bit of a treat and i have used it so it is open are these garnier moisture bomb tissue masks now i absolutely love these and for the price they are just amazing this is um the one with lavender in usually just get the normal one pop it on my face leave it for 15 minutes just chill and take off and then rub the like excess sort of like liquid into my skin and the next day or like later on that night my skin just looks glowy and fresh after just 15 minutes skin is intensely rehydrated skin looks suppler as if rested skin looks smoother so yeah I definitely find if you've got hangover if you're just feeling a bit crap pop one of these on and then it's like a little miracle product and you suddenly look like you've been asleep for about 10 years if you haven't tried one of these from this range go and pick yourself up one you will not regret it so that is it we have made it to the end uh, apologies for my coldy appearance and everything like that um i just really really wanted to film this for you guys i hope i hope you enjoyed it i hope you like seeing what i put on my face on a daily basis i will try and leave as many links to like the products down below if i can find them all but yeah thank you so much for watching if you have never clicked on my channel before then please press the subscribe button as that would be amazing give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed leave me some video suggestions down below because i love to read them come and have a chat with me i love having a chat with you guys as well all my social medias and like wherever else you can find me are always in the description too i think that's everything before i talk for ages but yeah like i said if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new and i will see you in my next one